It's uh, that that got kind of nervous giggle is kind of how I felt the entire game the other day. Uh, you know, because it's uh, it's exciting. It's definitely exciting. It's it's nerve wracking at the same time. Um, I swear, I was for the last two weeks before this game. Uh, I was anxious, definitely, and during the game, you know, starting off the way we did, uh, you know, not really executing the way we wanted to, um, it was was scary <laughs> at times. Um, but you know, these games are going to be like that. You know, they're going to be, um, you know, games you have to fight for the entire time. And so, uh, right now, the focus is definitely just on today, correcting, um, personally correcting, and uh, making sure we're all ready to go for another big game this week. So do you, do you have to like force yourself not to try to like soak things up when you're doing and just like focus on the execution? You do, yeah. you do, you do. Um, it sounds cliche, but you really do take things one day, one, t one play at a time. Um, and then when it comes to, you know, a career, look, we all know that um, we possibly have, you know, best case scenario, we have eight quarters of football left. And that's a great thing. That's what you play for. That's what you fight for your entire career. Um, so it's right there in front of us. Uh, but in another locker room on the other side of the country, those guys are saying the same thing as they should. And so this week of preparation, um, knowing that um, it's going to be very important. Then you're one of the few guys that have played in games of this magnitude. How much do you reach out to guys or do guys reach out to you about playing at this on this stage? Um, well, you know, this team had great success last year. Um, obviously, it wasn't an NFC championship game, but it was a divisional round. Um, got guys on this team that have, that have been in Super Bowls before, you know, me being, me being one of them, but it's not like we have a team that is a quote unquote Cinderella team that hasn't had any type of experience. And so that's a good thing. Um, it's good to have that type of game experience. Also, it's good to have the feeling of what it's like to be out there and to win and to lose. Uh, so for me, my biggest thing is encouraging guys, supporting them, letting guys know, look, it's going to be a 60 minute fight. Look, just because we're down 14 nothing doesn't mean that we can't come back. You know, we're built for this. We have our foundation set um, in our preparation throughout the OTAs, throughout the training camps, um, throughout this season, the ups and downs that we've had. That's where our foundation is set. And so the message yesterday was, look, we know that things, everything's not going to be right, but we can't be shaken by what happens. Uh, we have to have some resiliency, and, and we did.